Good morning, everybody. It is May. It is It is going to be May. I forgot it was May until I looked at the date just now. Uh, I'm your host, as always, Farting Tart. And today, we are going to play this neat little game I found on Steam. It's called Hell Sign. Uh, this game, I was looking, I was like, I kind of want to play a horror game on stream. And so I was looking at the, the horror games on Steam, and I found this game. And it is in early access. It came out in November of this past year, 2018. And it looks really cool. This is the description for the game. In fact, hold on. Let me actually pull up my display capture. If you want to do that thing. Okay. This is the game. Hellsign is an investigative action RPG that pits you against the horrors of the afterlife. Let loose on a small town. As a hunter, you'll plan, hunt, and kill to pay the bills and piece together the fragments of to your past. Just remember, a smart hunter is always prepared. So, I read this game a little... I read up on this game a little bit. And it is... In... A good way to describe it, it's a lot like a modern day Witcher. You get like, so like here, you can read up on like the different monsters and stuff you're hunting and then you hunt them and it just looks very, very cool. So the plan is to play this game today. Uh, it's an early access, as I mentioned before. I don't know how long the game is. Or even if there is an end yet. But I'm very excited to play. This should be a good time. It looks very cool to me. Honestly. Uh, and I'm going to try my best not to shit myself. I was watching one of the trailers for this game. And there was a giant spider. So that should be a good time. I don't know how I'm going to deal with that. Ooh. Boom. Hell sign. Okay, let me change the settings a little bit. Oh god. Oh god, the sounds are loud. Uh, excuse me. Give me that, those high settings, my dude. Uh, I'll keep the music up high and I'll turn the sound effects down a bit. We'll see how this goes. In fact, I think I've turned them down too low. <laughs> Woo! Okay, we're fine. <laughs> Uh, I'm hoping my face cam's in a good spot, because just about every corner of this game is used for something, so I'm hoping this is okay. But yeah, it still shows I'm in the... Um. Oh god, it's gone. Oh shit. Oh, where, where'd the game go? I went back to the main menu, and it showed it as if I was still in the... Oh god. Okay, hold on. Let me reboot the game. It I was on the main menu, but it still showed as if I was in the the options menu. So let me fix that real quick. I don't know what the deal with that was. <laughs> that was weird. I looked over and I saw like the options menu. I was like, that's not what I'm on right now. <laughs> that is very weird. Okay. Are we good now? Are we good? Are we are we great? We're great. Okay. So, new game. Oh, I could customize my character too. Uh, ooh, do we want to be a male or a female? Oh, we can't be a female yet. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna be this guy because this looks like Sam Jackson from The Hateful Eight. So we're gonna do that. Uh, we need to enter our name. Oh God, chat. The most important decision we'll make in this game. Uh. Um, Jam Saxon. There we go. Okay. Uh, so there are classes. So there's Stalker, which allows the use of traps, allows the use of bait and grenades. We start at level three. Mercenary. Extra damage with pistols, revolvers, and increased reload rate. Renegade. When gambling, whenever you, there's gambling in this game, 
Oh shit, whenever you lose, gain gives a 25% chance to sleight of hand some cash from the opponent. This increases upper betting limit. Allows the use of bait and grenades. Breacher. Proficiency in heavy armors. Allows running and dodging while worn. Allows the use of medkits. Hold the fuck up. Medkits are a skill? I, can Are these like my starting skills or can I get these as I go along too? I guess we'll find out. Increases your max health by 20. Field medic. Okay. Archaeologist. Allows crafting basic cursed artifacts. 100% increased chance to discover rare signs when investigating. Ninja. Allows the use of evasion footwear such as Geta and Tabi. Allows the use of specialized protective gear against poltergeists. Detective. Allows utilizing signs to gain a small advantage against all cryptids. Plus 25% chance, or plus 25% range increase to EMF detectors and parabolic microphones. Allows deducing poltergeist sub trait level 2. And then Drifter. Once the world told him to fuck off somewhere and die, he's still working on the dying part, but the rest has been surprisingly fulfilling. Specialty can play the guitar. Uh, I think. I think I want to go with the Stalker. I think that's what we're going to start off with. So, yeah, this game's a lot like The Witcher. You get, like, a thing you're supposed to hunt down, a cryptid or a poltergeist or something, and you're supposed to hunt them down and kill them or capture them or whatever. Start off with the Rusty Barrel Double Barrel Shotgun, a hoodie, an easy carry EMF detector, picks up baseline electromagnetic fields but has no filtering capabilities, a flashlight, and some traps, rotten meat, and cheap thrill. An unsanitary stem commonly used by homeless junkies, so that gives me health back. Okay. Alright, let's do it. Okay, that's the thing. Hold on. Let me... We're in a cutscene. Hold on. Hold on. My webcam frame didn't go away. There it goes. Okay. So... We wake up without our memory. We have this weird tattoo. Continue. Okay. Let me really quick. Scouting contract. Okay. This game's a lot louder than it may have seen before. Abandoned house. What the fuck is this hang thing hanging from the tree? I might need to turn this game down. This game's a lot louder than it originally seemed it would be. Oh god. Yeah. Turn, turn this down. Turn that down. Uh, music will keep about there. Uh, no, we'll, yeah, we'll go with this. I think this is good. Okay. Hey, cunt, we're over here. Rude. There you are, about time. Rookie Hunter. Banjo? Nice. Mate, are you the s Mate, are you the scout we spoke to? Scout? Look, cunt, you see this automatic rifle on my back? I've had a hell of a week and I ain't here to waste my time. Even lost my cat. So tell me your blade joking before I lose my shit. Sure. So you know what you gotta do, right? No, not a clue. Bloody hell. Alright, to give you a rundown, we had some abnormal EMF readings in the neighborhood, and we believe poltergeists are involved, but don't worry about it, mate. That's our job. Like we spoke about over the phone, we need you to scout the house for any paranormal signs and activity, so get your EMF detector out, head into the house, and suss it out. Okay. And when you're done, head back over here with any signs that you find so we can figure out what we're up against. Okay. Uh, go back to your vehicle and click it to access equipment. 
EMF detector, and then enter the house. Uh, are we just gonna ignore the fact that there's a fucking dead guy here? Oh! Yeah! No, that seems... That seems pretty bad. EMF detector. When you're not within... You're not within an EMF perimeter. Indicated by the needle on the bottom left. Try a different area until the needle responds and receive an investigation. Open your notebook. Sign your cursor, sign in perimeter. Okay. Good to know. Once a perimeter, get close to furniture and move cursor around in a high pitch until a high pitch sound is heard. Click furniture to investigate further. Okay. Oh. Get close to collect the clue. What clue? Okay. Oh, I don't like this. Oh! Oh boy. Oh. Supernatural. Rotten fruit. Evidence. Yeah, there are like maggots and stuff on that. You can't see that. Alright, I guess I need to move my webcam and stuff. Give me one moment. You know, you couldn't fucking see that at all. A little picture came up in the corner. Uh, I guess I'll be in the bottom right corner and I'll move it again if I need to. Yeah, no, a little picture came up in the top right corner of Rotten Fruit. Hopefully this spot's okay. Locate a corpse with a blood trail. Oh, there's a body over here. Use black light cathode to follow bloody trail. Oh! Oh shit. Porch black light. Eventually it will lead to the sign. Note trails can go under furniture. Okay. That's very cool. Is it here? Can I move the camera? I threw meat on the ground. I did not mean to do that. Accidentally hit Q. Supernatural amulet evidence. Okay. Find one more sign using EMF detector. Uh, that meat I just threw down, I'm pretty sure just went away. It was three, wasn't it? Yes. Still in the area. It's over here. Where was it? It was like here-ish, wasn't it? Lamp. Struggle. Pig mask. Evidence. Okay, find another corpse that follow its blade trail to find one more sign using a black light. Okay. There's one over here. These are like sigils. That's like a uh, Norse alphabet. It's 
stops. Blood. Clue. Okay. Now what? Take the signs back to Banjo. Close that. Cool. Hey, man. Mate, I don't care what fucking signs you found. Just hurry up and decipher them before we get killed out here. Pull that cryptonomicon out and start deciphering. Okay, J. Oh boy. Poltergeist, drag evidence signs into deduction slots. Decipher blood. Click on the tab corresponding to the clue type. Pathology. Forensic pathology. I clicked on the right one, right? Yeah. So, hold up. Oh, that's very cool. I I clicked on pathology. Did I do the right thing? Or is it is it just telling me to find the correct one? Blood. Oh, got you. Okay, so deci decipher blood. That is jaggered. Analyzing. Okay, and you're sure it's a banshee, right? Last time I trusted the new guy in town. Let's just say it didn't end well. I guess it's a banshee. I'm never wrong. Listen, we gotta finish up this job before we go, but you can bugger off. Mate, where's my pay for the job? Head back to town and find the shaggy jackal down on Valley Road. I'll meet you there once I'm done with the po this poultry, guys, and we can sort out your pay. So we just knew it was a banshee? Cryptids. Spiderling. Oh, fuck off. Ability crawls under doors. Banshee. Species poltergeist behavior aggressive. Banshees make up for the slow mobility by passing through matter. That's good to know. Just marking this stuff down. Excuse you. I would like to. Yeah? I love that I can't get the R there. Thanks for that. I'd like to get the R, please. Okay. Their wailing is known to tear an ordinary human to shreds. A tactical approach and use of sonic ear protection is highly advised. Their incoherent weakness to silver, weakness to silver, makes their immense strength contestable. However, they can also use it release inject. They can also release ingested spirits. Which, without a counter such as a triangular EMP, will quickly surround a hunter. Hold on. Triangular EMP. I like that. There we go. Okay. It's good to know. Alright then. I guess we leave now. Leave job. Hey, I earned zero dollars. Nice. Head to the bar and find Banjo. Bar. Is that Banjo? Yep. Sup, who are you? You're joking, right? Where's my damn money? You see that shady cunt in the corner there? With the black hoodie and crappy shades? That's Redback. Those signs you found? Well, you could get some serious cash selling them to him. A fixer, more like. Yeah, don't let the missing ear and shitty ass appearance fool you. He's sharp as a ninja's knife. That one. Word to the wise, watch your back around him. Last deal we last time we made a deal, he cheated me out of five grand and my fucking cat. My cat, mate. What kind of bastard takes another man's cat? This guy? It is this guy. You don't look like you're around for him here. You cop, who the fuck's in you? I haven't played cards with that guy in ages. How, did, how much did he tell you about me? Not a lot, but he did, did say you cheated him out of five grand and a cat. First of all, he wasn't even taking proper care of that cat. I didn't cheat him out of anything. Man's got a terrible poker face. 
Now that we cleared that up, I deal in the underground stuff. And I only deal with cash, none of that debit card bullshit. So if you're looking to pawn off anything paranormal, I'm the guy to see around here. So you, you got the signs? Let's trade. Sell, 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 sell. Cool. Head back to your safe house. Can I talk to anyone else around here? Zoe Roper. Cryptozoologist. God, stop that. Hey, player, I'm Kenny, but they call me Lucky Kenny around here. Anyway, if you watch uh, and play some blackjack with me, so, okay, this is the guy. This is the guy I gamble with. Can I talk to you? I don't want to be creepy, so... Shh, fuck it. Yeah, that's about how I figured that would go. Hey, man. Okay. Safe house. Seems about right. Oh, Jesus. Okay, how do I get out of this menu? Okay. Click on the crafting table to access it. Oh, this is the crafting table. Okay. Press J to open your Cryptonomicon. Kelpie? Oh! I have other shit. Access your skills. So, you. Ah! <coughs> Head back to the barn and find some work. Okay, so you can get other skills. That I'm gonna need to get immediately. So, head back to the bar and find some work. Leave. Bar. So, who do I talk to? Banjo? I'm looking for work, can you hook me up? Oh, really? I can think of some work right up your alley. Wink. Man! I ain't gonna pull your dick for money. I'm not that desperate. What do you have in mind? There are a bunch of jobs going around town, but so I can hook you up for sure. But I need to ask a favor from you first. I need you to head to a small shop down downtown just off of Parksville Road. It's a little place called Guns and Baits. You should see a puzzle box sitting in the front window. Get that for me and I will hook you up with any job you want. Alright, man. Guns and Baits. Hey mate, what can I do for you? You're another one of Benji's errand boys, are you? Because if it's for him, it's not for sale. Well, I can only lie. Thought he might have sent you that guy in his bloody, filthy hands that he can't keep to himself. Name's Noah. You a hunter? Uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, I thought so. So you must be here to gear up then. We just got a shipment with the latest range of double barrel. Double barrel 22s. Let's let me know if you need any help with anything. So did I get the puzzle box? Oh my god. Okay. I have fifteen dollars, so I really can't buy much of anything. I can buy a nail gun. Sure, I'll buy the nail gun. It's free. Why the fuck not? You can get some serious guns in this. Oh my god! You can buy an M14! You can just buy, like, some serious shit. Copper nails. I guess I'll buy some copper ma copper nails. Neat. Okay. <clears throat> so did I get the puzzle box? <laughs> oh. No, I did not get the puzzle box. Where's the puzzle box? Don't get me started on that filthy pig. If you see him around town, steer clear of him. That guy's bad news. I have some questions for you. Hmm, that's good to know. 
so I can upgrade stuff or tune it into specific things. What's up with your ass stock items? Okay, good to know. I would like to get the puzzle box. Where is the puzzle box? Auxiliary, medical. Where the I can buy a riot helmet? Oh my god. I'd like to buy a puzzle box, please. Give me the damn puzzle box. Where do I get the puzzle box from? Oh, there it is. Alright. Cool. Turn to banjo. My nose is running today, chat. Hey, man. You have no idea how rare these are. Which is why it was free, right? Now I can finally head south to take care of that damn cold priest. Okay, plus one reputation. Alright, I guess I owe you at least that much. Your pal, Redback, is always looking for new recruits, but don't get sucked into his bullshit. Check available contracts. Talk to Redback about some work. Got this job downtown, not too far from here on Tin Alley Road. Nothing too serious. Just a few small cryptids to clean up. You'd be interested? You mentioned fifty dollars. Sure, yeah. Okay, so once you're there, clear out the house and make sure you do a good job. The last few runners have been lazy as fuck and they killing my reputation here. What's done, head back over here and I'll fix you up. Okay. Plot job. Denali House. A triple homicide causes this house to attract a large amount of unwanted unwanted scavenging cryptids. A local real estate agency has hired you to sweep the place up and eliminate any threats. So, okay. Press V to heal. That's essentially what that's telling me. Whew. Your total health will be severely reduced for the remainder of the job if you use a health stem. That's actually really good to know. I guess that makes sense. So, <laughs> nice. Okay, so let's find these boys. This is where the scary shit starts, chat. Okay, can't see in there, cool. Cool. Quick weapon and click house door to kick open. Cursor was going a little crazy there. Target ground enemies. Clear the house of all threats. Oh, chat, I don't like this. I'm a really quick. I'm gonna turn down the sound really quick. Cause I'm a, I'm a little nervous. I'm a little bit nervous about this. Ah. Fucking spiders. All right, we're fine. We got him. We got him. Oh, Chad, I don't like this. Is this outside? This is outside. I don't think any are going to be out here, so we'll go back inside. 
Here, hold on. Put put that away. Also, this is a big ass house. God damn it. Okay, we're just sweeping room by room. Target the lock. Okay. Ah! Try whipping out your sidearm. Dodge! Reload, you fuck. Okay, we got him. I'm gonna turn up the audio back a little bit because it was it was very quiet there. That was not a very entertaining fight. Oh motherfucker. Really? Can you fucking not? I just heard one. I'm pretty sure I heard a noise. Come on, you fuck. Now that you're in there. Or maybe not. Alright then. God damn it. Oh, this is the starting room, I think. Yep. Okay, good to know. Okay, nothing in there. Hold on, give me one moment. Excuse you, friend. There's actually a, a spider on my wall just now. They're, they're figuring me out, chat. I'm gonna go wash my hands. I'll be back in just a moment. Here, now let's continue to kill spiders while I slowly leak feces out of my asshole. This balcony. Can they be outside? Or should I only go for... Should I only search the inside of the building? They could probably go outside. Hmm. I heard that running around. What was that? I heard the footsteps. I also did not see the store here. Fucking why? Why? I'm sorry! I'm sorry! What the fuck? Ow! Oh, I don't like this. Ow! I 
still need you alive, huh? Missing in action. I lost experience. I didn't lose any signs. I earned four dollars. What the fuck just happened? Okay. Was I supposed to die there? Or did I just get fucked? Okay, that was fun. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that was about. Uh, let's see this forensics job. Authorities have issued a contract for forensic specialists to collect evidence from a fresh crime scene. Note some areas are off limits. As a legit job, the sign rarity value is quite poor, but the, with minimal threats, it's a relatively safe job. Okay. I guess we'll do it. Oh, I need more reputation. Oh, I can't do anything then. Holy shit, he lives. Never thought I'd see you again, much less on two legs. Okay, so I think I was supposed to die there. What are you talking about? Dude, I found you in the shadow dimension with shadow beasts all over you. Any longer and there wouldn't have been anything left to find. What's the shadow dimension? Well, it's no regular place. It's an alternate dimension that you can get that you can get to with a health Wait, that reminds me. Why didn't you tell me you had a fucking hell sign? I'm guessing that's the tattoo. You know, the massive occult tattoo on your back that tells you that turns you into a magnet for the supernatural? What were you thinking, you idiot? Shit, you're serious. Sorry, man, I'm out of time here. Already late for a hot date with some twin sisters. But just so you know, this doesn't look good for you. I'd seriously avoid telling people you've got that mark for now. Oh, uh, my puzzle box went missing, and since you're the one who bought it, I wasn't looking for you. See, it had this weird tendency to make its way back to, to its... <laughs> it has this weird tendency to make its way back to its owner. Anyway, next minute I found you lying there like a pile of shit, and the rest is history. Anyway, mate... I'm getting out of here and heading down to Melbourne. Catch you on the flip side. Okay. Hey, man. You keeping out of trouble? Looks like this town's a good fit for you. Alright. Hey, girl. Okay. It's been three fucking days. Where have you been? This busy gig shafted by fucking shadow beasts. You call me a liar? There was nothing special about that job. So you must have fucked up somewhere along the way, yeah? Anyways, I assume you cleared the house because the client hasn't complained yet, so I'll consider the job done. But as a late fee, I'm taking a 90% cut. Well, fuck you, man. I died for $35. There's always a few jobs around, going around, and I could use some extra scouts, so I'll hook you up. So you know how these scouting jobs work, right? That crappy gear, not a chance, mate. Get as many signs as you can and get out. Don't try to be a hero. The next scout will pick up where you left off and continue the investigation. Maybe once you upgrade that lousy gear of yours, you can hope to pull off an entire scouting job by yourself. Oh, and word on the street is you have a hell sign. You might want to keep that under wraps. Anyway, since we are going to work together, I'll help you out this one time free of charge. There's this chick who is always hanging around the bar. I think her name is Zoe or something. I'll warn you, mate. She's not the full biscuit if you... What? What does that mean? If you know what I mean. No, I don't know what you mean. What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> She's not the full biscuit, chat. Okay. But she is your best bet if you want some answers. Hey. Hey, you a scout? Oh, yeah. What's your name? Ah, uh, doesn't matter. You need to go to this address here. Yes, have we met? Sorry, I forgot your name. Was it Roger? Matt? Oh, you got it. You named it. You got my name. Uh, anyway, you a scout? Just trying to find some answers. Uh, yeah. Oh, so you're a hunter. Look, I'm pretty swamped here trying to figure out how to this paranormal activity around town all pieces together. But I'll tell you what, help me finish this research and I will answer any questions you have. Deal? I'm not a hun. I'm not a hun. Yeah, sure, what do you need? So I've been studying the area and I've noticed a pattern with the paranormal disturbances around town. Ever since that shadow appeared back in 76 down at the docks, it's been crazy here. So I need you to gather a couple signs to fill in the missing data so I can figure out what's going on here. Anyway, or anything with the stench of a poltergeist will do fine. Find one clue and one sign... Find one clue and one evidence sign for Zoe. Uh, what was the scouting job? Which one was it? 
shout in the dark. Oh, I just need to find stuff? Okay. So, I guess we'll do... Should we do the forensics job? It's a safe job. It's risk one. So, I guess we'll do this first. Abandoned house. There are a lot of abandoned houses here, apparently. Yeah, maybe... Maybe th this will be what I need. This forensics job. I had a couple scouting jobs, but I'm not gonna mess with those yet. When I have a level one job here, because I have jack shit. I have a shotgun, a nail gun, and an EMF detector. I have a couple traps, but I don't think those are gonna do a ton for me right now. Okay. Check current job objectives in your notebook. Collect all signs, there's two. Okay, shout in the dark. Yeah. All right then, let us go in. Somebody's already crossed the line. I don't know if it's possible to find Oh, got a spike there. I don't know how likely it is that I'll run into enemies on this job. I'm going the wrong way. Is it in here? Jesus! Okay, yep. Good to know. Ow. Come back, bitch. Wow, really? Alright, fuck you too. Alright, well that answers my question. Good. Let me go back, because I feel like that was still in this room. Or you guys think it might be in like that room on the other side of that wall? I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, we'll we'll explore the house a bit more. I'm gonna get my shotgun out now that I know that there are actual enemies here. I think I'm getting a call. Can you fucking thank you, Fitbit? Yeah, I don't know that number. Cool. Okay, nothing in here. Let's go down here. I feel like it's gonna be in this room over here. And we have our body. And shit in here. I heard that noise. Don't fuck with me, game. I heard that noise. Maybe it's in this next room. Oh, we have our body. So let us follow the trail. That's a long trail. I'm assuming as you go along too, the houses just get like bigger and bigger. Okay, but I can just go around. Yep. Oh. Here, hold on. 
Jesus. I wanted to take like one shot at that and say I took four. Good to know. What was out here? Get closer to collect a clue. Ash marks. Interesting. So that's evidence sign one. And then we gotta find the the clue sign. Oh, I can't get into this room. There's another body here. There's nothing, no things there though. It's relatively quiet. Staircase that leads up here. Hold on, let me go back outside. Or maybe it wasn't here. I don't know. Hold on. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I think that area over here might have actually been outside. Oh shit. No trail there. Good to know. Oh. You trap in your inventory to operate utility. So I can turn on the lights and stuff. That's good to know. Okay, I can't go over there. So I guess we'll never know. That's fine. That's fine. Ah! Mm -hmm. Fuck you. Alright. That was the first real scare I've had so far. He was just chilling. He was just taking a piss. What an asshole. I'm so confused. I hear these noises. You can't bamboozle me. Hmm. It's weird. It's almost like it's in the wall. Sure, it's not out here somewhere. I'm very confused. Honestly, I think. I can see now why you want to, like, upgrade your gear and stuff. I want to say it's in this room, but I can't get in there. It's taped off. But I don't feel like a one-star job would be un incompletable. This feels like a job I should be able to complete. room up here. We'll try this really quick. Yep. Yep. Fuck you. I knew it was going to be in there. I knew there was going to be one. Oh, there's nothing in here either. Alright then. 
Yeah, I don't think I could really do much else right now. Yeah, I can't get into this room. There's a staircase there. It's almost as if I can get outside or something. Whatever. Whatever. Maybe try in here. Okay. This door over here. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, I don't know what the deal with that room over there is. There's a staircase right there. It's almost like there's a whole other section of this house that I just can't get to. I also could have sworn for a moment my EMF detector was full there. Hold the fuck up. Like when I first pulled it out. Ah, oh, whatever. I don't want to leave the job incomplete, but I may need to. It's like a whole little area right here. I think I need a tool to get through to police tape. So let's leave the job right now. Oh, you had to start the van. I didn't even fucking realize that. Uh. Oh. I think the game might have crashed. Uh-oh. 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 The game crashed. Nice. Good. It's great. Thanks for that. Great game. <laughs> I'm actually really liking the game. The game's very cool. Alright, let me load it back up. Oh, God. You know, it's like, I think I might need a tool to cut through police tape. Because God forbid I don't just use my hands. Because I just couldn't get through there. Let's go to Guns and Baits. Let's see if he has like tools to help me get through police tape. Toolbox. Or maybe I'm just at like a stage in the game where I just need more stuff to complete jobs. Those are guns. I feel like the toolbox is probably the big thing I need right now. Okay. Well, in that case, I can't even go back to that job. We'll do... Oh, these are the things I need. Oh! So these are like the recommended items I need. Okay. Well, we'll go to this forensics job then. Where there are probably going to be more spiders. So yay, my favorite. Yeah, no, there were those are some pretty fucking big spiders. But when I was looking at the trailer for this game, there was a massive spider, like as big as like the shadow beast that we saw earlier, like bigger than my character. So not looking forward to that. Not at all. I'm gonna turn down my headphones just a little bit. Just because I'm already worried about shitting myself. Bam! Bam! No trail there. Oh, I think it might be in this room. 
Hello? No trail there. Ah! Haha! -ha! Can't get me! Fool, hiding behind the door, your body's stuck to the. Okay. I wish I could get some for sort of payment for at least killing those things, but it's fine. It's fine, I don't need money. Might be in the next room over. No, nothing in here. It's silent. No trail there. Nothing. Yeah, nothing. Hold up. Go back down here then. There was also a room here. Could be a spider in here. No? Wow, genuine surprise. No trail. Alright, I guess I gotta go back to that one room then. Cause there's just not much here. Yeah, it seems to be in here somewhere. Actually, it seems to be a bit further like this way. Maybe it was in that bedroom. I'm confused. Maybe it's down this way? Oh. It went to 100 there for a second, but I think that might have just been a glitch with the thing. I will admit, EMF protector is a little annoying to use. Well, it's not annoying, it's just a little difficult. I feel like that might be more user error than anything. No, it's, it vanishes from that point. There's gotta be something close. Gonna check out everything. <gasps> it went really high there for a moment. Hmm. Man, I am confused. I feel like it might honestly be in the hallway.
Okay. Aw. Uh, what did it do that for? Book. There are lots of books on the floor. Glass. Maybe I missed something on the floor in that other room. Hold up. Oh, well, there's nothing really on the floor in here. I'm right here, so I want to figure out what's doing this. Maybe. No? I wanted to make sure it wasn't something like behind the door. Man, I really don't know. All right. I think we might need to just continue exploring and find the other clue. Am I sure there's nothing in here? It seems pretty dead quiet in here. Fuck you. Stop that. Is this the hallway again? This is. I don't even have a... Some areas are off limits. Yeah. I don't even have a trail of any sort. <gasps> I found the trail. How perfect. I, I find it as soon as I say that. Pendant. Evidence. Field manual. All supernaturals haunt the level in this way or another. Supernaturals can only be defeated by unleashing them to their true form. Supernaturals are bosses, essentially. Okay. When you die, you'll lose 66.6% of gained rewards in that job. This includes signs, cash, and XP. Note that you will lose what you gained from previous jobs. You will not lose what you gained from previous jobs. When unleashing a boss, this penalty the penalty gets reduced to 33%. When retreating, you will retain any and all of the stuff you got. Okay. Locked door. The keys are found like just like signs via gadgets. Okay. So it's just a matter of figuring out where this fucking other clue is. See, I don't want to just like start clicking on stuff because I feel like that won't do anything for me, but I feel like I may need to. I 100% move my cursor over that goddamn photo. Over that goddamn portrait. Well, we did it. Should I unleash it? Only possible in hunting grounds. Oh, okay. Alright, well, we did it. Cool. Finally. <laughs> yeah, I guess I just couldn't find the 
the clue in that last area. Right? Well, we did it. We did it, Reddit. Cool. Once you get the hang of this game, it's very cool. It's a little bit difficult to work with at first. But it's a very cool game. A very cool concept. Yes. Oh, did I not find... Oh, I need to do a scouting job. Okay. Here, I will take my signs to... What's his face? Trade shop. Oh, blood crawler entry. Cool. So now I have $79. Excuse me, I would like to leave. Exit. Leave. So I need to buy a parabolic dish. PM30. I need $120 for that. Jesus. Alright, well, I guess we'll do another scouting job then. Or another forensics job. Alright, so there's a bit of farming involved. A little bit. You gotta, like, make money to be able to get more stuff so you can do the bigger jobs so you can get more money. Etc, etc. I guess that makes sense. That makes sense. At least we're currently only dealing with little spiders. And they... I guess we dealt with Shadow Beasts before. But I don't think I'll have to deal with them again for a little while. So, did I get... Cryptids. Blood crawler. Okay. That's good to know. So I might be able to run into them. Honestly. Okay. Hello, friends. My signs that we got just two. Now it's this way. It might be in this room here. Let me make sure I'm clear. Okay, we're fine. Also, I never found the body in that last level. I just found the trail. I don't know where the body was originally. Might be in here. Fuck you! I'm ready for you, bitch. Come here. Come on. Yeah, that's what I thought, bitch. Anyways. I get very aggressive when dealing with spiders. No trail. Okay. Might potentially be in here. No. Oh. I definitely... Okay, I guess I have to be close to the object too for it to come up for the EMF detector to detect it. Because I, w I scanned that before and it was not giving off any signs. See, oh, we've got a little bit of a trail. 
Nice. Found it. Statuette. Now we can leave. Hey, that was easy. That was easy. Really? I thought that was the door I came from. It was apparently not. Uh, Where's the door out? Is there a map? There's not. I think I also just threw... Ah! Fuck you. I think I accidentally threw meat on the ground, which is why that spider came out. Ah! Now I got the willies. So, that's good for everyone, right? Alright, leave job. Also, I'm pretty sure I'm the only person on Twitch actually playing this game right now. Which is a shame, it's a very cool game. Okay. Uh... Actually, how much money do I have now? Let's check really quick. I have $86. So I'll probably need to do at least one more scouting job. Or forensics job. Let's go ahead and just line it up. I wonder if I can use evidence from previous cases to unleash and identify monsters. So that would be pretty cool if that was the case. You know, this game is a little slow in the beginning trying to figure it out. Because we're already over an hour in. But... I can imagine it picks up quite fast once you really get going. Alright, spider boys. Let's do this. Where you at, fuckers? Just gonna make sure there's none in here that want to run and attack me. Nope, okay. Nothing in this room. Alright, I guess we'll just start from the beginning then. Nothing here. Any trails? Nope. That's a blood trail. Yep. Found our trail, boys. Let's go to the chair. No, it doesn't. Shirt. The shirt was the murderer. Rope. Evidence. That's the bathroom. There's nothing. Gonna, there's gonna be nothing in that bathroom. Scout out the house. See if there's anything in here. I wonder if it's possible to have like blue... Ah! Yeah, fuck you. I got a skill point. Uh, I, I gotta go to the safe, safe house to use that. Good to know. Ah! Ah! Ow. Yeah? Okay, it's gonna be much easier to just reload the shotgun. Fuck you! Having an epic battle with this little fucking spider. Fuck you. Alright. Uh, that's clear. <laughs> Didn't I come in this room before and nothing attacked me? Alright. Cool game. Oh. It moved a little bit. Here we go. In here somewhere.
maybe in this room actually. Yes, it's certainly in this room. Somewhere. There we go. Hey! Now we can head out. As soon as I remember how to get out of here. There we go. Cool. Alright, another job in the books. Huzzah. So what, we're... We've got three for four. Because that was our fourth job and the first one we left. I guess technically three for five because there was that very beginning job. Okay, let us sell our things. Ah, dear! I didn't drop my ball cap. That didn't happen. Shadow pages. Interesting. Alright, we have enough for the parabolic dish now. So let's get that. Nice. Exit. And then we will head back to the safe house. Uh, what was it? Skills? It was you. Allow deduct allows. Okay. Eh. Subterfuge. We're gonna go with first aid. I feel like that will be good. I feel like I'll probably need that at some point too. Uh. So field manual. Parabolic microphone. So the parabolic mic comes with a built-in filter to record electronic voice phenomena. EVPs. Environmental hint, odd ambient sounds. Perimeter indicator, same ambient sounds but louder. Use it to scan the area, and the area until hearing a ghastly voice. Paranormal interference. Okay. Got you. Okay. The environmental sounds quite distinctive, but if in doubt, simply whip out the mic to confirm. Okay. Cool. So I guess we will just leave them. So now we can do a scouting job. Let's do... They're both abandoned houses. Recent Massacre... Yeah, okay. So let's do this one. Wow! This one is way more money than the last one. The last job gave us $7 plus whatever we sold. This one gives us 65 if we do all objectives. Jesus. Although they did say that scouting jobs might be a bit too difficult. The one guy said that, Redback. So we're gonna see how this goes. Gonna see how it goes. <clears throat> so we need to bring her one clue, one evidence clue and one, or one evidence sign and one clue sign. Get out. Oh, I already have it. Alright. We must be going. Good. Great! I'm glad I did that. I want to die. There are six signs. So we have to deduce what's here. But if we get all the signs, we get an extra ten bucks. Ah! 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 I found the blood crawlers, guys. I fucking hit reload. Come on. 
Okay, was it just the one? Because I think there was two. Or was that the one that came out here? Did he go back in? I don't fucking know. Found the body. Ah! Wow, there's a lot of you! Wow, level two is really a step up from level one. Oh, I thought I reloaded, damn it. Come here, bitch. Fuck you. Wow, we've gone into like two rooms and we've already killed four things. There were three spiders in that one room. That's crazy, man. Blood trail. No, it's gonna be in here. Come here, bitch. God, it's really unsettling that they could just go under doors like that. Let me actually reload really quick. I'm gonna need to buy more ammo soon. At this rate. Let's clear out this room first. Okay, we're fine. Trail did not go this far. Fuck off. Really? Really? You just did not take damage from that? What's up, Timmy? Play on playing more horror games? Uh, yeah, if I don't die of a heart attack first. I don't know. It might be a thing. This is why you shouldn't trust farting tarts, my dude. <laughs> yeah, man. If you got if you got a push, it's probably not a fart. Oh wait. Oh, did the blood trail? Oh, there are two blood trails. Oh shit. Ever tried SCP containment breach? No, and I fucking won't, cause that I I'll fucking die. Maybe the the online version where you play with other people, but fuck, I can't do that shit, man. That fucks with me too much. No? Oh, I see. Yeah, one of the very, very cool things about this game is that it's almost like a Witcher game in some regard. Like, you gotta figure out what killed the people. You gotta... Yeah, I can't open the fucking book. Can't look at the book. Oh, there it goes. Gotta figure out what killed the people. You gotta do all these things. You can like compare notes and prepare, or you could just go in guns a blazing. It's very cool. Online version of shit. It's too focused around meta strategies. Well, that's why it'd be great for me, right? Because I wouldn't have to worry about sucking because everyone in that game sucks. Um, is out here? Yep. Cool. Tape one. You know, I just came across this game on Steam. It looked very cool, so I decided to pick it up. I'm enjoying it so far. It's a little slow to get going, but it's still very, very cool. So that's four signs. I want to get all the signs, if I can help it. 
I should have pulled out my shotgun before I came in here. You have a trail? You do not. Also, I like that this game has indicators for various things, like more ambient noise if you need to listen in with the microphone. Very, just various things. It's a mix of Terraria, Zelda, and Stardew Valley. Oh, you're talking about Forager. I was like, are you sure? Are we talking about the same game here? Yeah, no, I've heard Vor Forager is very cool. I might try it out on stream soon. It's apparently, like, incredible. Here. No blood trail there. However, that woman does not have a head. It's behind the door? No. I am confused. Has to be in this room or this one, right? Has to be in one of these two rooms. I don't know where else it would be. Timmy, you don't have to do that. Don't worry about it. You're in college. You need all the money you can get, man. Oh. Shit moved around there. Huh, maybe it's in the hallway. Maybe it's like one of these paintings. Or something on the floor. This is where this game kind of flaws a bit because it's like I don't know where this fucking thing is it, there could be a room on this side like behind this wall that I might be in so I guess we'll go over and see now that's just a bathroom hmm like a weird man I'm sorry. Back. That's not worth going into that room. trying my hardest to find this fucking thing. I get what it's trying to do. It's trying to get you to like put the EMF detector up to it. It's like trying to do like a proximity thing. But it's just, it's just weird. It's just a really weird mechanic that doesn't work quite as well as I would like. Maybe I'm just an idiot. That's always a possibility. And of course, Sometimes there's stuff buried under other stuff, which can make your life a bit difficult also. 
I want to say it's in this room because I'll come in here and stuff will like shift around all spooky like. I don't fucking know. Alright, let's, let's look around a bit more. Nothing in here. Nothing in here at all. Alright, that's fine. Uh, okay, oops. This is outside. Could it be around the back side of the house? No, I can't go that way. Body here. Oh, I got a thing you here. The chair did it! Okay, so stuff can be outside. That's very good to know. So it's possible that that other clue I've been looking for might be outside. It might be around the back side of that room. So, hold on. Let's go back out the front door. I'm sorry that I'm spending so much time like going in between the same two rooms trying to find the same goddamn clue. I think I can go out that, get over there that way. I think I had a hit there for a second. Did I not? Maybe I didn't. It's just this one clue that I need. Just the one. I need to figure out what it is. I have to. Let me... Let me look at the EMF detector again. Get close to furniture and move a cursor around until a high-pitched sound is heard. Click furniture to investigate further. Move the cursor around that piece of furniture? Again, stuff's moving around. Oh! Oh! Okay, that was weird. That was weird. It said it was like in between the two. Okay, I, I'm not going to give myself too much heat for that. That was weird. And I searched all around that room. Okay, so yeah, you need to actually like move the cursor around that piece of furniture. Not around the room. I thought if I just put it on the piece of furniture, that would be enough. I didn't deduce what's actually here. So, hold on. We've got... EVP. Oh, Jesus. They use the Ouija board to unleash it. You know, this is bad things. Bow took place. Maybe? Blood crawlers, that makes sense. Evidence. Oh, maybe not. Note? Do I have to use the. Ah, okay. So. Ch ch structural. Conflict. Kelpie. Spiderlings. Trap type damage over time. Ability to effectively damage supernaturals. 
Help me. But it says spiderlings. Oh. Oh, so. Oh my gosh. So there is a Kelpie here. So how do I. I need to find the Kelpie. Or I could just leave. Is there a way to find the Kelpie? Because I've unleashed the Kelpie now, haven't I? Unleash only possible in hunting grounds. So I I probably know it's here, but I probably can't do anything about it yet. Only way to pierce its shell is through incendiary round or explosive pressurized gas. Okay. High space melee attacks. Yeah. Thank you for coloring in the space there. That's my protection. Okay. Alright. I just shot my van. Oops. Guess we just leave then. We did it. We did it, Reddit. God. It took me forever to find that one damn clue. So now we will go back to Zoe. Give her the things. But I want some special favors in return. Dude, don't be fucking creepy. Nice. $70 for that. Hell yeah. Now I just need to cross-reference those with the giant pile of newspapers from 76. And I should get some answers. So what do you want to ask me? So I woke up with no memory of who I was or what had happened. Hmm, interesting. Now I got this giant hell sign on my back, not to mention the recurring nightmares and headaches. I have read stories about this before. I'll be honest, it could be from a number of things, from cursed brains to an al to alternate dimensional snapback. But my guess would be an altercation with a powerful poltergeist. I would have to do some research though to find out for sure. Look, I really can't be sure without studying a little further. But I get the feeling helping you find your answers will help me figure out what's going on here, so I'll help you out. Alright, you. Anyway, Lefty mentioned you were in loop with Redback, and I heard he sh sells artifacts in rare Poltergeist pages. Any chance he could see if he has a shadow page on him? Yeah. Redback has a shadow page. Boom. Has a journal page. In fact, actually, while I'm doing this, I can go ahead and sell these. That was $38 for that little statuette. Hell yeah. Give shout page. Oh wow, I didn't actually expect him to have one. This is so exciting. Here, this could cover the cost. Nice! Hell yeah. So I looked into your situation a bit more and found an identical case like it was back in, from 1966. Right around the time, the Great Dimensional Tear. Don't know if there is any correlation, but I thought you should know. Let me put it simply for you. You know the, how wormholes resolve the Aaronfest paradox? So due to the as oh God. Asym can't. Asymptotic projection of the Kalabi Yao manifold. Stop saying fucking words that I can't fucking pronounce. There's a compromise of the Eisen Ro Einstein Rosen Bridge. Yeah, it's just a theory, but I'll need a while to decipher the shadow page. Okay. Cool. So, extra contracts in the meat of it. Look for work around the bar. Uh, sure. Let's do a let's do a game. Uh, pot ten. We'll do ten dollars. Oh, it's blackjack. I didn't fucking realize. Hell yeah, I love blackjack. Uh, I have to hit. Fuck. All right, deal again. Hit. Damn it! I got an ace. Hit. Damn it. Hit. Fuck! Tw three twenty threes in a row! Fuck you. Alright, well I tried. Hey man. You know where I can get any work around here? You should talk to my man Big Shot over there by the door. Okay? What do you want, boy? Just looking for some work around town. I don't got a scout job going right now. I could use a squeaker to get me some fresh beast parts. 
Sure. Oh yeah, that's what they call them in the business. Just a fancy name for someone who leaves the small fry and sells their parts. Yeah. Alright. Cool. Get four ghoul parts and bring them back to the bouncer. Good. Great. I got a deal going down at the docks, but I need some help to make it run smoothly. If we can pull this off, we will get a new holy shipment of weaponry like no other. Uh, yeah, sure. Alright, so basically we're getting mates to chip in 200 each, which will go towards paying for convoys, bodyguards, and the shipment itself. If you help me out here, I'll help you with some VIP access and discounts on any gear you want. Sure. Okay, so a couple days to get that money back. Or to get stuff back. Deal with the docks. Wait for Noah's arm deal to come through. Uh, how much money do I have now? I still got $64. It's not too bad. I need to buy shotgun ammo. I get 25 for 6 bucks. That's not bad. Oh, that's what I have. The rusty double barrel. That's good to know. Uh, can I get some headgear or boots? I think I have shoes on, don't I? Hold up. I don't have shoes on. Alright, let's get some mountain boots. Cool. I got mountain boots now. Uh, accessories. Me, impact the main, medical. Oh, I needed a, a thing, didn't I? Shit. Oh no, I still have one. Oh, it's got charges, so I guess they the charges restock every time I go to a mission? Okay. Wow, that's a level 5 scouting mission. Jesus. Alright, I guess we'll try the sweeping mission. Let's do it. I'm gonna fucking die. We'll go in, we'll see how it is, but we may need to bail halfway through. <laughs> so we'll see how this goes for us. I probably should have done another scouting mission. Oh, there it is. Okay. So those boots should give me a bit more armor. And I think it gave me extra health, too. Knock, knock, motherfuckers. I thought that was a body. Ah! My god! Hey, man, what's up? Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, my god. I wasn't ready for that. Okay, yeah, this is not going well. Okay, the game lagged there for a moment. I saw that. Don't try that shit. I got a ghoul part. And achievement. Yeah, I'm not ready for that. <laughs> that was one. I killed one of them. There's still more. I need better guns if I'm gonna do shit like that. So I'm a I'm a bail. I'm a bail out while I still have the chance to. <laughs> that was that was rough. It takes like it, I think like three hits from that guy could kill me. I still got $19 though. So that's not too bad. Uh, let's do another scouting mission then. We'll go for this one. Oh my god, I wasn't ready for the guy to just jump down from the ceiling, arms extended, like foot long claws. I figured when it said ghoul, it was gonna mean like a ghost. And I was like, oh, that's not gonna be too bad. I don't know how I'm gonna shoot it with a shotgun. That was way worse. That was way worse. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, so the, the stem regens. 
for every mission. Hello? So there are six signs again. We got blood trail. I will look into this room first though. Yep, hey. Oh, good, there's two of you. Ow. Really? Really? God damn it. I keep forgetting I only reload one bullet at a time. Okay, there goes one. Ah! Fuck you. Oh, that was the weak one. So I killed this guy in one shot. Nice. Hell yeah. Okay, let's check out this corpse. Follow the blood trail. Let's go here. It does not. I'm now just waiting for another guy to pounce on me from the fucking ceiling again. <sighs> Jesus fucking Christ. Fuck you. Goddamn spiders. I ain't about your shit. I need to find that trail again. There's a different trail. Okay, neat. Isn't this the same room from before? Okay. The book did it. The book's the murderer. I'm not gonna open that. Yep. Yep. Saw that coming. Oh my god, there's a bunch of you! God, fucking reload the gun, asshole! Oh, got both. Nice! Alright, that was fun. Anything in here? Anything at all? No? Was there no point in coming in here? Nice, good. Guess I killed those things. So if I just complete the objective and then leave, does that mean that there's technically still just a bunch of shit in here for the person to just return home to? Cause that's a little fucked up if that's the case. Nothing in here? All right, cool. How many do I have? I have three. Cool. And that was the the body which that I just followed. Yeah, that's the trail. Okay, nothing in there. I keep expecting spiders to just launch out from the beds. From under the beds. Jesus, why? I'm sorry! You have a good time in there, sir. So, that's a thing. Satan's in that room, just chilling. Uh, I think we'll come back to that. Maybe. We're not gonna, not gonna fuck with that right now. That's a bathroom. I doubt there's anything in there.
if it's over here. Maybe it's in here? Just shake my cursor wildly. My honestly, hold on. Just checking this anyway. I feel like it's somewhere on this shelf. It's my perimeter. It could be in a different room. Ah. There we go. Cool. I just got a buzz. Alright, thanks for that. You made a, ma a lobster build in PoE? That's cool, man. I don't know how long ago you sent that message. I just now saw it, so I apologize for that. So, um... That ghost, huh? I don't know if I, uh... If I want to go back in there. That was a poltergeist. I feel like I might have to go back in that room though, unfortunately. As much as I don't want to, pretty sure I'm gonna have to. Oh, it's fine now. What, that ghost just threw a box at me and then fucked off? What an asshole. All right, neat. I think freaked out there for a second. I do kind of wish it could give me some sort of hint as to what I'm supposed to be looking for. Because so far it's kind of just go into a room, try a bunch of shit, oh no that shit worked, alright move to the next one. Okay. I need to make sure there's not another trail anywhere. We got, what, two trails already? I feel like it's gonna be too... Why'd you do that? Why'd you gasp like that? Stop that. We got two evidence, we got a sign, we got uh, one clue, we got a fucking... record. Recording, that's what it's called. I feel like I might need to do another recording somewhere. But as to where, I am not sure. Am I sure there's not another thing in here? It was that thing out there? It was. Okay, cool. I do also wish I could move a bit faster while doing like the EVP and EMF. It could also be outside. 
We have had that one scenario where the stuff was outside. Stop doing that. Oh. Might be out here, but there's oh, oh, it's the body. Okay, let me go back because it does do. I I do like that the creepy stuff that happens is usually a sign of oh, it's in this area somewhere. And we had one occur over here, so it might be in this hallway somewhere. I'm gonna equip the dish. Because we have one recording, so it might be another one. Hmm. Unless that was all of them. No, there's one more. I could, however, just go ahead and deduce it and then leave. If I really wanted to. think. No, because I only have one clue. Spiderlings. Oh no, I can do it. Uh, symbol. Esoteric. It's another Kelpie. Stop that. All right, we're just gonna bail. We're just gonna bail. Oh, where's my car? Just making sure it's not out here somewhere. All right, leave job. We didn't get everything, but it's fine, it's fine. The stuff we still got will give us quite a bit of extra money. And that's still... Getting everything is only an extra $10. So, I mean, honestly, it's fine. Also, I'm glad there's not, like, a trade-off. Like, oh! Um... Yep. There's not, like, a thing like, oh... Um, you need to keep these things for later to make... Just in case you need it. No, you can... So far as I can tell, you can just sell things the moment you get them. Should I get more pages? Corp Paras Corpse Parasite Entry. If I get these pages, will these things spawn? Oh no, because the ghoul we're already dealing with, so I should get the ghoul. I will get all these pages right now. I feel like that's going to be the smart thing to do. Just go ahead and be prepped. So, we've got cryptids, we got ghouls. Just don't cling to walls. Dexterous and tough. They use momentum for a single heavy attack, which is best evaded. Rely on mobility and wall clinging ability to escape out of harm's way. Bear traps are useful for immobilizing them or to open a window for a full retreat. Okay. Corpse parasite. That looks like fun. Parasites are immobile, but thanks to the range of that, they can pin down enemies from awkward positions. Luckily, they are quite large. Hipfire should be utilized for va from vantage points close to cover. Nephilim. The most important thing to remember... I'm sorry, invulnerable? Is that Nephilim are immortal. Therefore, the best tactic is to retreat without hesitation. One must be careful not to run onwards to uncharted areas, as stumbling on a dead end or other possible... Hostiles during a Nephilim assault can often lead to a horrible death. So, a rift phenomena from the blood dimension are eventual souls who, of those who died in... So I guess it's just, like, hands coming up through the floor? God, so... Alright, we've already found a thing that we straight up just can't kill. That's fucked up, man. Shadow.
I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. It says it's a poltergeist, but it said they're extremely sneaky arachnids. So are they like ghost spiders? Because I will shit myself without a second thought. Hunting? Oh my god. Okay. I guess we'll do another scouting mission then. I could. I have bear traps. So I could use those for the sweeping mission. But god, I still feel like that's a bad idea. We'll wait. We'll wait. We'll do another uh, scouting mission. I don't trust myself to be good enough to do a goddamn sweeping mission. So do you think that... No, because it was a Kelpie. Why was... I mean, what the fuck was that thing that just chucked a box at me? Was that just like an event? I don't fucking know. I don't know. Whatever. Alright. Let's go on. Okay, not this way. Is that this way? Nope. Alright, cool. Still going the wrong way. Oh, I should have probably bought more ammo too. Fuck you. God, he spawned the moment I opened that door. I haven't even been able to walk through the house yet before I got attacked. Let me actually. Anything else? Yep. Fuck you. Fuck you. Ah! Fuck off. Wasn't I in that room? Come on, fucker. I know you're coming back. Yeah, that's what I thought, bitch. Anyways. God, yeah, I should have saved my ammo. Or I should have bought more ammo. I can assume that's probably all that was in here, right? I'm gonna fucking hope so. Got an EMF reading. Now it's further down this way. It's this plant. Um. Is it this? Hold on. Is it this, like, cabinet over here? Is it the plant? Oh, no. It's this cabinet. Okay. Then there was a voice. Okay. There's another one. Okay, cool. I'm ready for you fuckers, come on. 
Show me what you got. Okay then. Guess we'll kick open some doors. Damn it. This is not something I thought I'd be doing today. Shooting big ass bugs with a nail gun. It's a, it's a weird day. It's a very weird day. All right, what was this room? Is this a bathroom? Bedroom. With nothing in it. Oh, I lied. Blood trail. Ate immediately found the thing. Hell yeah. Oh, this is the room we were in before. So I shouldn't need to use my parabolic dish anymore. We only need one more. And I feel like the chances are that's going to be another EMF reading. That would make sense, right? Yep. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Glad that happened. Cool. Good. Just the bathroom. I'm not even gonna bother opening that. Okay then. What's in here? Yeah! We're on top of things now, boys. Nothing in here? Huh. Not a single thing. This is the front door. There's a, there is the potential though. The potential. Nice. Good English. Uh, am I planning on going back to PoE when the flashback goes live? Uh, maybe. Possibly. Last week was a little hectic, so I didn't get to do much with PoE after the stream, but I'll probably go back to it soon. just trying to I think I got a hit there oh no just stuff freaking out there's the potential that the other thing is outside I don't know can I go ahead and debunk it because I might as well, right? Well, not debunk it. Um, identify it. Blood crawlers, yeah. Uh, so, blood. That is... Jaggered? Another Kelpie. Even if I find the Kelpie, I can't do anything about it yet. You can get things that you haven't seen before. Hop, cough, cough, breaches, cough, cough. Yeah, no, I'd like to return back to POE sometime soon. 
Alright. Hey, man. Got you some stuff. God, that that tape is was forty dollars. Hell yes. Okay, let's go back to guns and baits. Buy some more stuff. Oh yeah, how's the deal going? Oh, it's gonna take a couple weeks. I thought you said it was gonna take a couple days. Fuck you, man. Fuck you. item I might need to consider buying a oh actually I should definitely get this because that gives me two that gives me two shots I got $57 buy a magnet light That's better than the flashlight I have. Sure, let's find the Magnolite. We're slowly getting more and more prepped for the, the sweeping thing. Oh, I didn't buy ammo, fuck. Do I have enough? I have $7. Yes, okay. Whew. All right, we're fine. <laughs> I also got a skill point, if I remember correctly. Yep. Oh, I have two! I didn't even fucking realize! Allows the operation of electrical utilities in household. Oh, to enhance traps. Eh. Invasion footwear. That, I feel like I'm gonna need to get. At some point. So a proficiency, yes, let's do that. Okay. And then I don't remember what all the buttons here in this room do. I think we will go to a sweep mission and maybe kill one guy. <laughs> So, let's do it. <laughs> Even just killing one, I get 20 bucks. About 20 bucks. So, what we're gonna do is that we are gonna put down a trap in the very first room we go to, and then we're gonna throw meat on it. Unless there's a guy already in there, which is possible. Because that, the trap, I think, is gonna be our best friend here. Okay. Uh... Do I have my traps equipped? So I need to do that. How do I use my trap? Press G. Oh, did the Magnolite attach to my shotgun? Or has it always been like that and I've been fucking dumb and never noticed that before? I think I've just been dumb. Hey, man. Ow. Nice. Oh, G's not doing anything. Wow, really? I also didn't equip my goddamn... No, I don't want to escape. Ow. I might need to. Jesus, he is gonna kill me. Oh, what? I disagree. How do I fucking use my traps? Equip large trap six. We're going back. We're going back. Oh, I disagree with that one. That was lame. Also, again, he was in the very first room I opened up. <laughs> that was that was bad times for me. I also didn't equip my new stem, so I only had one shot. So good. Great. 
If I can do these like hit and run missions a few times. Where's my Um Excuse me. Where's my ship? I have the cheap thrill, but where's the one I bought? Okay. Well, let's do this first, I guess. Um Launch trap. How do I? Seven? Oh! Okay. Can't place trap here. Why not? Please tell me that. Okay, that doesn't trigger on me. Not what I wanted to kill, but okay. Can I reuse it? No? Okay. See, I saw the meat sign, so I assumed it was a fucking... It was a piece of meat. But then I realized just now that I didn't have meat, because I threw it during my panic last mission. <laughs> eh. <laughs> Get over the table. Ah, get over here. Hey, man. You fool! Oh, that's not doing anything. Ow! Okay. Note to self, don't use the, the nail gun on them. It's not effective at all. Oh, okay. How many of those things do you think there are? Kill cryptids, two. I've killed three, though. Does that mean there are two types? Or does that mean there's two left? Or is it because I killed two types? You know what? We're doing well. Let us continue. Let us, however. I hope I don't need. I hope I restock on these automatically. Friend. Friend. Okay, we seem to be safe for the moment. I can actually go back in here. I could scan this room for various like stuff. Unless there's there's not gonna be stuff in here. Because it's a sweet mission. The only objective is to kill things. Oh. Alright, good to know. I'm checking just in case, because it may give me clues anyway. Hey, man! Come on, fucker. I'm ready for you. Ah! I'm sorry! Aha! Oh, what? Fuck you! Ow. Okay. I need to bail. Excuse you. Oh! Not fair! Not fair! Not fair! Not fair! Oh, I'm trapped. Oh, I died! Damn it! Not fair! He phased through that door! That motherfucker! He phased through the damn door! Okay, what the hell happened to my stem? Where did that go? I bought it, didn't I? Medical. I didn't buy it. Oh, it's in storage. Oh, it's probably in my crafting table, isn't it? Yep. No? What? Oh, storage. Oh. 
Ah, ha, ha. I got you, game. So how do I... How do I move that to my car trunk? Can I only... Okay. Weird. Whatever. Oh, this is where I craft stuff. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Hey, good news. We kept one of the meats that we caught last time. We're going to do a... You want... No. Look. I think we could get another one. Let's get another... Let's get another meat boy. I feel like I could have won that fight had I had my fucking stem out. <laughs> my new stem out, but I didn't. I was trying to get back to the car to run. But I kept getting caught on shit. Alright. So, right here. I do need to be wary, though. Because I only have... Oh, I don't have traps. Oh, my traps didn't refill. Well. Right, I didn't fucking... Ow. Oh, I disagree with that. Come on. Are you shitting me? Are you actually kidding me right now? <laughs> I am in disbelief at what is currently occurring. I got one. You guys fucking not. Come on. Fucker. Yeah? Alright, I killed a cryptid. Does that count? Does that. Yep. Alright, cool. I can now leave. Peace. I just got mauled by fucking spiders and then I left. I need more ammo. God damn it, dude. That is very good to know that your traps do not restock. Can I bot? Yep. Bear trap. Cool. Good. Well, now if I want, I could go back and kill another thing. Let's do it. No. I'll be smart. Let's do a scouting mission first. Let's get a bit more money. You're gonna take time to see how long it takes you to be Act 9 for POE? Do it. Do it. Ugh. Four spiders fucking flew out of the room. By the way, I know it's an abandoned house, but if I owned the house and that fucking occurred to me, I would just set the entire thing on fire. I wouldn't even fucking care, because there, if there are four in that one room, there's guaranteed to be more. I just want to set the house on fire and just fucking leave it. It's a sweet mission. It's fine. Boom, bitches. Boom, bitches. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Ow. Poltergeist was not a fan. He was not a fan of me. I tried to get out of that room and I couldn't. Because I'm inept. How many do we have? We have six here. Nothing here. There's a blood trail. Oh, there's two. Nice. Nice, you. Uh. 
still going? Oh, it is. No. Is it going in the room? It is. Alright. Sup, fuckers? Ah, it's a fucking A! God! I knew they were gonna be in there and it still fucking got me! Oh, I'm not aimed at the ground! Matt, you asshole, you're just getting mauled by spiders! God, this room is so fucking small! Yeah? Okay. Fuck you. God. <laughs> I think it was because they spawned before the noise occurred. Like, a hair just before the noise occurred. And I saw them, and that scared me. I think that's what got me. Oh, okay. We're fine. Where's this fucking clue? Where's the trail end? There it is. Nothing else in here. Where's this trail go? It goes in here. Yeah. Okay, we're fine. Oh wait, did it go in here? Oh, it might have gone in the other room. Oh, nope, there it is. Goes to the plant! The plant did it! Uh, two more. I think one's a clue, and then one's a recording. Where you at, friend? Might be on the other side of that wall. sure it's in this room. Hey friend, Al. Come on, bitch. Come on. Fucker. Okay. Ooh, that leaves me with less max health than the other one does. that in this room. It's close. Oh, maybe it's in here. What the hell is it? There we go. Murder? Murder, she wrote. Sup, fuckers. Yeah, better run, bitch. My fucking thought. Okay, how many rooms are left that I haven't explored? If it's a recording, it might be worth getting because that's an extra ten dollars and then whatever I would get for the actual recording so I feel like that on its own is worth it especially if it was like before 
were one of the recordings I got was worth forty dollars. Where is it? Got it. Oh, maybe I didn't. Oh, it's this one. Alright, cool. Collected all signs. Now we leave. Gotta deduce what it is. So, I get that I unleash it with the, the clues and stuff. I'm assuming unleashes it, unleashing it makes it spawn somewhere on the map. That would make sense, right? Spiderlings. Because part of me wants to... I'm pretty sure that's parasitic. I can tell just by fucking looking at it. Pathology. Part of me wants to see if... Like, wants to run into it. Is that Possessor? I think that's Possessor. Oh, it's a Banshee. I don't know. I wouldn't mind looking into it. But then again, it would. It has a good amount of shit. I don't have sonic ear protection. I don't have a triangular EMP. Probably best just to flee before it just murders me the moment I find it. This game is very fucking. Cool. It's so far, it's a little kind of bare bones, but I feel like it's gonna really pick up once I actually get going. Like, once I get more equipment, I'm able to do more missions, etc. etc. I have $192. I want the pirate eye pack. That increases my experience gained by 25%, but halves my accuracy. Hmm. That's cool. Oh, so you need clues and stuff to crap. Ah. See, I thought it was weird that you would, that the game would be like, oh yeah, just sell everything you get in a place. I was kind of like, ah, oh, all right. I should probably buy a pistol to replace my nail gun, in all honesty. Oh my god, I need... I need certain skills to use attachments. Oh shit. Okay. Interesting. Let's buy... a Sec-9 Compact. We will get... How, what kind of ammo does it use? I'm assuming... Yeah, 9mm. We will buy... FMJ rounds. Okay, we get 200 from those. From $6. And then we will buy some bear traps. I should buy, I'm gonna buy an impact grenade. Part of me wants to see what the impact grenade will do to a fucking, to one of those big guys, one of the ghouls. Right. 
We will go back to the safe house. Gonna equip that weapon. So, can I... Okay, so that's in the storage. Or in the trunk. Oh, I can't have both. Okay. Well, that's fine. Yeah, so that will just... Bring something out. That's just like a lure. I want to use the grenade. I want to see... It does 8 damage? Huh. Oh, mostly small injuries. So that's probably good in case I run into... Like a group of spiders or something. Okay, that's good to know. That's good to know. Alright, let's try... Let's try a sweeping mission. Let's do it. We're gonna... We're gonna see... If we can kill two of the big guys, two of the ghouls. We're gonna at least kill one. At the very least. Maybe we'll get lucky and we'll be able to kill everything here. I have another gun now. That pistol, I feel like, will make my life easier in terms of spiders. Hey, man. I found the, the parasite. Ow. Yeah? I feel like that's cheating that you can just shoot through my van, but alright. I mean, he just shot straight through it. I'm gonna leave. Cause he fucked me up. He fucked me up. And I've already done the mission. Those guys... Those guys do a lot more damage than I was going to give them credit for. Shit. Alright. <laughs> Going back in. So, I feel like the hunting mission... Hunting missions are where the bosses, like the Banshee, the Kelpie, stuff like that. I feel like that's where they actually spawn. Once you unleash them, they're actually there in the world. Because... I feel like if they were in the scouting missions, that it would not be like a level 2 mission. Or maybe hunting missions are for stronger things, I don't know. Okay, let's put down a, a thing. Put that down there. Just for when the big guy comes out. Why did I just shoot? Oh, I threw a grenade. Didn't want to do that. I thought I had the meat out. Okay. So nothing in this main hallway. So far. So let's kick open this door. Yep. Oh, there's another one. Ouch. God, I wish I could reset these traps. I feel like that's a big downside to using those traps. Okay. Let's put another one down then. Close that up. Okay, so the spiders don't even trigger bear traps. Ow. Alright. Cool. Did that. That's why I did go in here, because I figured there were going to be spiders in here. Or not. Alright. I didn't want to go in there and then the spiders trigger the bear trap. 
Oh, it takes four shot. Okay. So it takes multiple shots to open a door with a sidearm. I guess that makes sense. Not really, but whatever. There he is. Get over here. Hey, man. I fucking missed my first shot. Ow. Yeah? Good stealth. Fuck. Oh! Did you see that epic dodge? Hell yeah. Alright. So that's one down. Do we want to leave? I have the potential to get $82 right now. Holy fucking shit. We're gonna keep going. We're gonna put this last trap we have down here. That's our last one. Friends in here? No friends in here. Surprisingly. I want to get closer. Okay. Ah! There he is! 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 I was waiting for Fuckface to show up. I knew there was going to be one more. Hell yes. Oh, I haven't killed all the cryptids though. But I don't want to fight another one of those things without bear traps. <sighs> this is outside. What are the chances that there's another ghoul somewhere? <sighs> there's three rooms. God damn, let's fucking do it. That seems like cheating, but I'll take it. <laughs> oh no, I'm getting... Okay, so it is counting all of them. Well, some of them, I guess, don't count then. I... Or maybe it is types. Wait, what have I killed so far? I've killed a ghoul, I've killed a spider, I've killed... I heard a noise. I, heard... I killed a blood crawler, I killed the... The corpse parasite. Cryptids. I haven't come across a Nephilim. Maybe it counts the ghoul twice. Like, I killed two ghouls, so maybe the other ones are only... It only counts one kill towards that? I don't know. That's weird. Can I hit him? No, okay, I can't. Is that it? There's still more. It's gonna be a thing in here. Probably a corpse or a spider or something. Okay, that's not bad. Damn it. Come here, bitch. And we just got the thing to kill all of them. Hell yes. We can now make our way out. That's a lot of death I just caused. Leave job. Hell yeah. We did it, Reddit. Okay, so that was a bunch of dudes I killed. $145 for that job. Hell yes. Okay, before we buy anything, or before we do anything, let's restock on ammo a bit. Shotgun ammo, certainly. Uh, I'm gonna buy two of those, because I got a bit 
Uh, we'll buy one more thing of pistol ammo. Just because we have a lot of pistol ammo, but we go through it pretty fucking quick. You killed any ghouls yet? Yeah, man. Thanks for the meat, bro. It looks super fresh as well. Don't call it meat. That makes me think you're going to eat it. $240. This will make a great ornament in the gift shop. Oh, okay. So, what's up? What do I do now? Check back with Zoe for research results. So I've been studying the patterns of the paranormal occurrences in town, and if I correlate the electromagnetic emissions against my baseline and past findings, it lines up perfectly with the hypothesis and historical evidence. What does that mean? In short, it's highly like it's highly likely there is a poltergeist behind this phenomena. No shit. Well, we'll see that we'll need to research the poltergeist directly so we can zero out on the exact point you lost your memory. Since you have a house sign, you can make yourself useful and get me some samples. I thought all you folks with hell signs are knee deep in that cool stuff. Do you even know how to evoke poltergeist? Not a clue. Well, I can't help you with that. I deal with science, but surely you can find someone around town to help you. Cool. Look for someone to learn evocation rituals from. Oh my god, so I'm gonna have to learn how to summon like bosses and shit. You know anything about evocation rituals? No. Okay. Can I sell you stuff? Do I have anything to sell you? I don't. I have so much money. I'm gonna buy this schematic for the eye patch because it's only twenty dollars. Bartender? You know anything about evocation rituals? Back when I was in the game, it was just guns and machetes. Now you youngins are with all your high-tech gadgets and summoning hoodoo. Sorry, mate. It's beyond me. Dude, you look like you're like forty. Come on. <laughs> Nah, not today, but do you know anything about evocation rituals? Do I? Mate, there's a reason they call me Lucky Kenny around here. And let me tell you, it ain't because of the pretty face. I got some business to take care of down the road and could always use an extra pair of hands to help me out. You mentioned evocation rituals? Come along, I'll show you how the pros do it. Alright, man. Oh, you meant now? Oh, fuck. A few hours later, in a side alley, down at Port Adelaide. Alright, that should do the trick. Got 50 cents, bro. Quick, there's there's our chance. Grab that homeless guy over there. I'm sorry, what? Something is wrong. This is ne was never part of the plan. Dude, this is messed up. Haha, <laughs> I know, right? You look way different than the guy I was talking to a minute ago. Oh my god! I feel like that's worse. Wait for it. Foolish morals, I will devour you both. So he was the bad guy all along. Yeah, he looks way different than how, like, than he looked when I was talking to him a minute ago. Also, this art style is fucking sick. It's like comic art style. I'm all about. It. Hey, thanks for helping me out back there. A job well done. Stop suffering, bomb. <laughs> Hey man, you don't look too good. You feeling okay? This is the kind of stuff you need to get used to in the field. The spirit that came out was called an Echir... Ekri? Ekri spirit. They feed on the soul like a bloodsucker. Usually you can banish them, but this one was too far gone. Yeah, they are pretty rare nowadays, but every now and then they come through the triple six... What? The triple six... Wi oh. I got it. I, got I understand. With a powerful poltergeist and latch onto the first human in sight. Nasty little fuckers. You want to be a hunter and you don't know about the triple six? You might ought to hit the book before you head out solo. Anyway, the triple six is what they call the dimensional gates. It's believed that there are 666 of them. 666 of them, although only 137 have been mapped so far. I'm sure you'll have the pleasure of entering some on your hunts. Wait, I still don't get why the fuck they call you Lucky Kenny? <laughs> See, here's the thing. It was sort of 50-50 I had the right guy. Imagine my relief when the egg <laughs> <laughs> Showed up when we after we cut off his arm. <laughs> Jesus K, you're a real cunt. A lucky cunt. Ha ha ha. Okay, cheers for the info, mate. So where can I find some poltergeist? I like you, man. You had no hesitation holding that guy down while I took his arm. And even after that, you want some more. I'm gonna hook you up with some contacts around town. But you are on your own from here on out. And this is the real deal, so stay sharp out there. Oh, new unlock, hunting jobs. 
Oh my god. Hunting jobs are the tough ones. Oh, I don't want to do that. Initial scouting indicates ha house is haunted. I need more shit to do this too. Thermal activity. Ooh. It's haunted by an active poltergeist. You're contracted to investigate the area for valuable signs. Also, a lucrative bounty has been placed for eliminating the poltergeist. Extremely dangerous approach at your own risk. Holy fucking shit you can get a lot if you actually kill it. If you deduce it, that's still a decent amount. That's like 600 That's almost $700 if you can get all the signs and deduce it. Jesus Christ. Ah, my main man, the, day, the deal ran smooth as a baby's behind. The new shipment is here. I hope you are as excited as I am. Just about everything from grenades, baits, guns, launchers, attachments, specialized hunting gear. Remember when I said you got, you name it, we got? Well, now it's not a lie. Alright, I'll come back to that in a moment. I just remembered I have a thingy. Increase your health by 10. Guns. It allows the use of gun sight attachments. That might be good. What does that say? Okay. Last deducting, Poltergeist sub trait level 2. Oh. Very cool. Artifact crafting. Sure, man. Let's do that. I can craft the pirate eye patch. I don't have the stuff to craft it with, but Vietnam M16 is a thing I can craft. Okay. Cool. So, I don't want to do the hunting one. I'm really hoping that they add more shit to this, because as far as I can tell, it's just these four that I can get. Like, these are the four, only four bosses in the game so far. But there does seem to be more stuff up here, so maybe there is more stuff. Maybe there's a lot more that I just haven't come across yet. Oh my god. UV projector. Spectral tripwire. Jesus Christ. Why do they have little... Oh, that just means they're new. Bloody meat chunk. Cluster grenade. Dynamite. Forsake kit. Epinephrine inject injector. That'd be good. Paramedics backpack. Gas canister. Good lord. Orion Mega Torch. Heat reader. Gray Thor EMF meter. Wow. Toolbox. I want to get the toolbox. Protective earwear. Night vision goggles. Night vision goggles might be good. Let's get the night vision goggles. Fuck it. Uh, do I want new boots? Now nah, I'll save. I might buy a new gun though if I can afford one. I can't right now. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. So do I have? Uh, I have that Mr. Goggles clipped. Okay. Let's do. Oh, this is a. This is quite a high scouting mission. Do we want to? You want one of those, actually? A recent chain of disappearance has led to a priority contact contract. Electromagnetic interferences suggest an incoming rapture flagging job as dangerous. An active poltergeist confirmed on site collects signs of deductive identity as part of your contract. I still need the the thermal thing to if I want to do that though. So we will let's do another sweeping job. Oh, I need to buy more traps if I'm gonna do that. more of these bad boys. 
we will buy eight of these. Do I want to buy a gas canister? No, I won't do that. Whew. Okay. Uh, we can do a forensic job. No, let's do let's do a sweeping job. We'll do another sweeping job. How long have we been going? We've been going about three hours. A bit over. Nice. We'll keep going a bit longer. I need to actually read that text message. Hold on. Okay. No, that's fine. That's totally fine. Alright then. So. Where's the house? Okay, it's down this way. I probably should have followed the fence. Hey man, come at me, bitch. Oh, so it might be easier to hip fire on those guys because they're so big. Huh. Okay. You actually give me one moment. Oh no, that's fine. Okay. room. Throw that down there. This place has a lot of rooms. Ow. Really? Really? Ah, fucking don't breach the door, asshole. Well, that could have gone better. Hey, friendo. Come here. Okay, I was ready for spiders to rush out of there. I feel like there's only gonna be two things here. Tell Zoe you're ready to resume the research. Oh, I should have done that. Okay, I will do that after this. Good. Ow. Here, man. You stay in there. Ow. All right. Or maybe I'll stay in here. Oh, what? Oh, fuck you. Excuse me? What, you can just phase through doors like that? All right, all right, that's fine. He just faced through that fucking door. Hey. Oh, hey, Matt, what nightmares? Did you end up finding the cryptid collection book I needed? Did she get my name from my PC, or is that just a name she's calling me? Because that'd be a really funny coincidence if that was the case. So I've been digging a little further into missing scouts and hunters around your episode, and I believe it might have something to do with you, but you'll, we'll need a you to record some EVPs from the veteran scouting grounds around here. God. From veteran scouting grounds, so I need to go to the big boy places. Right? Yeah. Good. 
Great. I can technically go here without the thing. But I'm not sure if I should. God, I'm so upset that that one fucking guy killed me. Let's do another hunting job. Another sweeping job. That was so stupid. He just phased through that door. If he had broken it down, that would have been one thing. But he did not. It was as if that door just wasn't there. So. That was good. That was great. Alright then. Oh, here we go. Uh, also, it's very good to know that I cannot place down traps while in combat for whatever fucking reason. Why can't I find this place this trap here? Alright, fine. Okay. First things first, we will put this here. I also don't know how many traps I have on me. I assume I have all of them. Ow! Okay, that's one. Yeah, nice shot. Oh, this just goes back outside. Nice. Maybe I should have gotten that upgrade to increase my max health. Nothing in here. Cool. Oh, I disagree. <sighs> you really have to move to the side. You have to dodge to the side or your dodge just really is pointless. If you dodge back, you you just you still get hit cuz they still lunge for you. You're essentially just doing nothing. Wow, I thought there were going to be spiders in here. I'm sorry, did I just do 15 damage to him and that didn't kill him? 15 damage on the second shot? God damn it. There we go. Okay, my trap is right there. Hey, friends. Ah! There's one more. <laughs> See, I got... I have credit for four kills. I've only killed three types. And I've certainly killed more than four. So I don't know what it's counting. How it's counting what. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> there was a weird noise, and I guess my chair just did like a little squeak because I was very confused by it. Just trying to figure out what the fuck it was that made that noise. I also need to remember I have grenades to deal with spiders. Hey, man. What's up? Get out of there! Okay. <coughs> oh, I haven't been in here yet. Let's put down another trap right here. Nothing. 
nothing. Okay. Unless. No, okay. Just making sure. I feel like there's still gonna be one more ghoul. Oh, yep, 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 yep. I was like, oh, I guess there's nothing in here. Oh, was I wrong? Was I very, very wrong? Hey, we did it, Reddit. All right, let us now get the fuck out of here. Whew, okay. This is a good game. I really like this game. I don't know how much more of this game I will do on stream, but I, I, I'm digging it. I meant to go to the other thing. Uh, so can I so I meant to go to the bar, Matt. Go to the bar. I went to the bar. Can I still sell you? No? Can I sell you the, the parts? Oh, I didn't get any parts from those guys? Oh, fuck off! Fuck off with you. That's lame. I <laughs> think Grease Gun might be the way to go. Let's get the Grease Gun. We'll sell the Sec 9. Maybe. Ah, uh, maybe not. Hold on. So, what do you take, friend? 9 by 19. 250. We'll buy two, because that's going to just blow through ammo. Hollow rock salt. Oh. Now I can get other types of ammo. Nice. Wow, there's a lot here. Wait, do you have shotgun rounds? Do you, so now we can fight a Kelpie if we want, and some other stuff. Nice. Okay, that's good to know. Chat. Against my better judgment, I may be going to one of these scouting missions. Oh, that counts as a primary? Oh! I thought it would have counted as a secondary. Well, that's a little rough. Uh, hey, man, how much would you give me back for selling this back to you? Not enough to where it's worth it. Fuck. Okay. I have a thing that gives me bonuses for sawed-off guns, right? Or does it just remove the submachine? Oh, submachine gun proficiency too. Okay, we'll try the submachine gun then. All right, chat. We're gonna go for one of the veteran scouting missions as soon as one comes up. Oh, right. I still don't have the thing. Oh, well. we'll we'll try it out. We'll see how it goes. We're gonna see how it looks. Also, I didn't really mention it. This little floating thing up here in the tree, it looks like somebody just photoshopped, like, a thing just kind of, like, standing there and just kind of put it in the tree and then, like, put a rope behind it. It doesn't really look like it's hanging. It looks like it's just standing there in the sky. <laughs> oh, God. I'm a bit nervous to go into this. Just a little bit. I'm not going to be able to get all the things, but I can at least check it out and see what's what. Maybe get some EVPs. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Ow. Hey, you know what would have been nice, Dor? Would have been if you had opened up when I moved the mouse over you. But that's fine. Ah, oh, damn it. Got 25 bullets per mag. Can you open, please? Thank you. Where you at, friend? 
Is it in this room? Oh, oh, yeah, he's in here. Okay, I was wondering if there were gonna be ghouls in here. Oh, fuck off. Oh, oh, God. Oh, he came in through a window. I still haven't reloaded either. Yeah, okay, that's about how I expected that to go. That's one of the reasons why I wanted to go in there. I figured there were going to be ghouls in there, but I wanted to make sure. Okay, so, fuck the submachine gun. The submachine gun is good if you're fucking, like, go, uh, I guess, like, early tier missions. Where it's just, like, fucking bugs and shit. Shotgun is not, shotgun is what I need for that shit. God, I was not expecting him to come back through the window. <laughs> oh, man. Do we want to go back in there? We'll go back in. We'll try again. We'll try again. Whew. Alright, Timmy. See you later. Oh, man. I was not fucking ready for that. So, good to know, ghouls are definitely in this mission. I figured they would be, but I wanted to make sure. Also, I have the night vision goggles. Do I have to equip those, or do I just have them on? I feel like I just have them on, right? Can you not? Whatever the fuck that was, it just says increased vision plus 50, so I guess I just have them on. Where the fuck do I go? There we go. I didn't think I could get, could get through that. Okay, so let's, first of all, step A, throw that down. Friends? Friends? I can't get through that. That's a locked door. I need the key to get through that. Okay, we're fine. I had to make sure there was nothing in the bathroom. I think I'm getting farther from it. Yeah. Alright. We'll check some of these rooms first. In here, maybe? No? How many clues are actually here? There's seven. Wow! Oh, never mind. I thought it said 700 for collect all signs. I was like, okay, damn. Oh, I had to deduce two things. There are two things here. Oh, shit. That is very good to know, actually. I'm sorry. Oh! 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 
Ah! Back! Back, demons! Oh, come on! Get out of the damn corner, Matt! For the record, I have no idea how I'm killing these things with a shotgun, but okay. Wow. Alright, that was wrong. I used both my shots on that. Both my stems. Was this worm even worth coming into? I just have like a residual EVP. There it is. Got it. Okay, cool. EVP clue. So... I need two of those, right? I got two. Oh, they're level two EVPs. I got you. Ah! 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 Oh, fuck off. I disagree. Get into the trap! Trap! What?! Oh, I rolled! Fuck you! Fuck you! Oh my god, and I lost the EVP. Are you kidding me? Are you serious? I lost the damn EVP. God, this game's rough. This game's really fucking rough. Okay. Well, on that note, I think I'm actually gonna end the stream there. I'm gonna go put some food in my belly. I got a bit of work to do. Uh, thank you to everyone who showed up today. Uh, this is a very cool game. It's kind of bare bones, but I feel like once you get really going, it gets a lot more in depth. Um, I might return to this on a future stream uh, when I progress in the game a bit more. But yeah, so thank you to everyone who showed up. Uh, YouTube, thank you for watching. Uh, I hope you all have a great day, and I will see you all later. Take care.